Thanks for staying with us. Midday Kentucky, we are live at the 43rd Annual Home and Garden Show. Thank you so much for being here. We're here with Elizabeth Montgomery Hi. of Three Toads Farm. You're in Winchester, yes. so you are local. Yes. What do you have here at the Home and Garden Show? We have five different varieties of lily bulbs. Mm. Um, this is what they turn into. They're gorgeous. Um, yeah. Our bulbs are the biggest, best bulbs that you can get, and that's what makes a really great flower. The bulbs that you get at Lowe's and Walmart are about half the size of ours, so this is what makes they're a good huge. flower. Those I mean, they're the size lost. of our face. Yes. And they yeah. smell amazing. I was going to say, Amber's nose got in there. Well, <laughs> I love and my And they flowers. come back every year. Oh, they keep they mm -hmm. keep blossoming. Really? Yeah, every year. Wow. So, can people buy these here at the show? Yes, we have five different varieties. Um, one very similar to this and one very similar to that. Whoops, knocked the petal off. <laughs> <laughs> well, here's a quick question because I think, you know, if people don't catch you at the show, where do they go to actually, where can they mm -hmm. find you We're all We're at the buy Lexington them? Farmer's Market. Um, Saturday, almost every Saturday in the summer. Okay, yeah. So that's a good place to find us. And you can always call and order. We're not open to the public. If people want to come out to the farm, they need to sign up for one of our workshops in the summer. Now, speaking of workshops, Amber and I were talking about this. Uh, you do seminars and workshops. And yes, we do. This will be our fifth year of doing a field to vase workshop. People bring a vase. We walk them through the flower field all behind the scenes, and we teach them to make a huge event style arrangement. Um, it's wow. a really special night, and they get an old fashioned made with our oh, ambrosia. A little concert. extra incentive. Yeah, <laughs> we like that. All right, let's talk about your events because you have a major honor that was given to you by Martha Stewart yes. as one of the top wow. 10 farmer florists in the entire United States. Yes. That's awesome. Did you all hear that? Because that is just, that is huge. It is, and it's really crazy because we are a tiny flower farm, but um, this farmer florist movement is just a really big thing. Um, it's vastly different from another florist because what we have is what we grow. It's what's in season. It's fresh. It's much better than anything you could get shipped in from a wholesaler. Everything's and local. Everything's local. Um, and you can really tell the difference in the quality. Um, and our style is a little different. We have flowing greens. Uh, we don't have that tight, you know, 1980s yeah. sure. ball arrangement, <laughs> you know. Well, you can also, if somebody tells you what they want, right. Elizabeth was telling us. Yeah, we'll grow flowers grow a year in advance wow. um, for a bride, a special color, a special variety, um, but they got to get to us early. A year in advance. Yeah. Now, you touched base real quickly on your all's jam, which. Mm -hmm. I'm addicted to jam, so tell us a little bit about that. So our best seller is actually right there. It's ambrosia can serve with bourbon. Mm, Not only is it great like straight out of the jar or on oh, any English yeah. muffin, <laughs> um, you can take a dollop, put it in a glass of like a shot of bourbon, crushed ice, soda, and it makes an old fashioned. It's got the orange rind, cherry cooked <sighs> right in. Okay, you can't, I know, it, you can't beat that. You're talking bourbon and flowers, bourbon and, and it flowers. is that time of year. Yeah. So yeah. let's talk about events that you do. You do weddings, birthday, anything anybody wants? Anything, yeah. Any we're, a full, we're a full service Big. florist. It's just the difference is that we grow our flowers. Oh, it's so cool. Everything's from right here in Winchester. Yes. It's not like when you go to the store and you get something. Right. So, and, and let me tell you, they are gorgeous. Yeah. They're huge and beautiful, beautiful. How long does it take for a lily to grow? About a hundred days. And it depends on the time of year, but it's generally about a hundred days. Wow. So if you plant those bulbs now, they will come up this summer. All right. Well, thank you so yeah. much. Come see Elizabeth and her beautiful flowers. Order some. You can pick your own color in advance at the Home and Garden Show. Stay with us. We'll be right back with more little teas of what's here.